Welcome Sunset Motors. My name is Frank Gerard. We're located in West Tennessee. I bought this beautiful 2019 American Coach. This is the American Eagle Heritage Package. The floor plan is a 45C. This is the ultimate RV. It's got everything you can think of. Look at this big one slide. 40 foot long one slide on one side it just opens up the floor plan inside just like a house full body paint they even got the painted graphic that runs through the window gives it a nice stylish look and also it cuts down on the sunlight coming in it's just in light new condition powered by the 605 horsepower Cummings 15 liter 1950 foot pounds of torque it's an incredible machine i pulled a car and i couldn't even tell what's back there lots of power it's on a freightliner v-ride chassis which gives you incredible stability it doesn't sway back and forth in the curve like the other ones do it's kind of hard to describe but it, it handles amazing and also it has the ultra steer the back tag will turn at 15 miles an hour or less to help you with the front wheels and increase the steering angle by 17 percent and believe me i could tell the difference pulling in here or well, actually backing up in here as you can see i've got a narrow entrance and usually i have to go back and forth and make a bunch of maneuvers on these big rvs this one is a one shot i couldn't believe it the back wheels turning just helps tremendously also with this one you get the wider tires for increased stability the 315 80 22 and a half it's all aluminum wheels I've got camille here my my wife she's gonna help us out lots of storage that one is a watch your head that one's a manual slide you got one on the other side and the other one has got the optional power slide which is really nice because once you load these things up they get pretty heavy with your water or all your gear and you can slide it all the way out very nice also previous customer had a ladder install which is kind of nice on these rigs so you can have access to the roof for some maintenance it's got the central vac this here's your thermostat for your uh it's got the heated basement so if it gets too cold it will provide you with heat keep things from freezing up and this is a first also how about a a lipo lithium battery pack it increased the capacity tremendously and it lasts a lot longer and they're just better batteries i've never seen that it's an option pretty expensive option makes it where you can stay out longer without being plugged up of course for your outside entertainment you've got this 48 inch tv you can watch the ball game it's on a bracket that extends out and tilts you got a sound bar at the top very nice here's all your some more electronic this is the inverter chargers a 2800 amp pure sign inverter you've got your automatic transfer switch with a surge protector they've done a good job with all the wiring it's all pretty and neat and it's got keyless entry for the main door and the cargo door so you don't have to walk around and lock every single door and also you've got the keypad with a combination you can go in and out without a key some more storage here you've got the chassis battery and the engine battery and some cutoff. Here we've got the engine compartment. It's on a power extender. Let me see here, extend. Is it opening? There we go, here it comes. I guess I wasn't seeing it. So I gotta hold the button. All right, and right here's a nice and clean engine compartment. 
access to your hydraulics, engine oil level, transmission, that's your leveling jack, which this one has both system, the leveling, hydraulic leveling jack, and also the air leveling, which I really like if you're in a, on a nice driveway or some soft ground, you can use the air suspension to level off. It'll level the corners, which is much better than the jacks for, you know, short term. How about this nice heavy duty side radiator? Beautiful engine. 15 liter, what a monster. You've got the 15,000 pound towing package, so you can tow just about anything you want, all your toys. On these American Coach, you've got the optional emergency door, which is kind of handy. If there was a fire inside or an emergency situation, you can just jump out the back if you can't come out the front. There's your diff fluid, there's a gauge outside, and also on the dash. I'm probably gonna forget stuff, there's so much on this thing. There's your water closet here. Get your hose. It's on power reel too. Get your gauges, lights. It's got the, the flush where you can flush the, the tank. It's got the macerator too and the pump. So if you park and you need to dump uphill, this will actually push it out. Cool stuff. And also the water filtering system for the whole coach. I guess I forgot to put a paper towel up here. And this is the big boy here, the Aquahot heating system. This will heat water on demand. And this is a 600D. It's the big one. And also it heat the motor home too. So get some quiet heat and take long showers if you need to. As long as you got water, this will provide unlimited hot water. And it'll burn a diesel fuel in the tank or electric. You got your 50 amp service on the power reel. Nice and clean. This is the other side of the slide out. Oh, I guess this one retracts. I didn't know it did that. It comes out this way. Oh, cool. It does it both ways. This thing's got so much stuff. I learn every day. And you got a little few accessories here. This piece of wood goes in the shower inside, but the previous owner removed it because he didn't think he needed it. But it's right there and you. Access to some more electronic components. Got an airline where you can hook up a hose. Or if you were down on air, you could push air in the system. Oop. You want to hold that on out as your washer fluid for your wipers. I really love these mirrors. Good visibility. And this one's got the 360 camera system, which is really hard to describe, but it basically shows you a picture of all around you. There's another camera here, one on the back, and it makes a 360 picture. And it's just like having a helicopter shot from the top. I'll show you inside, but it's pretty awesome. 12,500 watt generator, Cummings, with only 80 hours on it. On the power tray, which is real nice for servicing. You can go back inside. And these lights are great. Usually motorhomes have pretty weak lights, but these are LED lights and they're really bright. Great visibility. I drove this pretty good trip. It's just an amazing machine. There's the other camera for the front. The wipers on top, which I like. You don't have to, they're not in your face. They're out of the way. You don't have to look at them. All right. This is the keypad that we're talking about. This door is on the airlock for a nice tight seal. Beautiful rope lights all over. If you have a pet or small child, you can close this foot cover. And the seats are just amazing. The nicest seat I've seen on an RV. First, you got the suede, ultra leather, high quality. They're heated and cool. You wanna turn the TV down? How about that heat and cool? It's about time. 
they have them in high-end cars, so why not in high-end motorhomes? And they're massaging seats too. I don't know if you can hear it, but it will give you a back rub. Very nice. Both seats do the same. How about this interior? Doesn't get much better than this. Better than any hotel you can go to. This cockpit too is really nice. All nice and modern. There's an iPad holder. That is my iPad, which you can stick yours in there. And it's got some outlets. Keep everything charged. Also, you can get an app where you control the motorhome with, with the Wi-Fi app. Like on the blinds and climate and things like that. About this leather dash, leather wrap dash. Usually it's all that plasticky. And finally, a nice high-tech display. High definition. I guess I can crank it up. There we go. It's all pretty. Easy to read. Gauges. You can customize the bottom. You can move stuff around like fuel mileage. All kind of different things. You can move stuff around. There's your air, two air system gauges. Uh, here's a camera. That's the front camera, but this is my favorite view because you can see all around the motorhome, 360 degrees. But you can get different things, whatever you like. I mean, that's kind of crazy going down the road like this, but I think this is appropriate right here. Also, if you want the camera on this side, you can have it, but that's the, that's the whole idea of having two 10-inch screen. You can move stuff around. There's your navigation. It's got Bluetooth for your phone. Uh, and it's Rand McNally navigation, so it's kind of set up for motorhomes. It's got a defroster, which is really nice. I actually use that. So you got the defroster here and that's your climate control on this side passenger has their own climate control how about that dual climate control uh, and also you got power power telescopic and tilt steering wheels right here tilt how about that very nice and adjustable power pedals so if you're short and you need to bring the pedals back up to you, you can do it with this button. Very cool. Lots of buttons here for control, camera select, generator, uh, got heated power mirrors, got memory seat for the seating, uh, engine brake. You've got low, medium, and high, and that really works on the mount in the mountains. How about a power toll? They call it a tow window, I think. Very cool. And nice six-speed automatic transmission from Allison. And that's your air system. Right now I've got on the air automatic air leveling. Alright, I could stay in the cockpit for a while, but I think I've got other things to show. How about this? Very cool. Some more buttons for the shades. All the shades are powered, blind. Everything is soft closed. Yeah, I showed him that. You haven't tried that yet, it's pretty awesome. All right, you've got a, I believe that's a 40 inch TV here. This wood is really nice. It's all real solid wood. Lots of keys. Got your slide controls. Got your HD antenna booster. It's got the 4G booster. For your phone and your Wi-Fi. And the wine guard HD direct TV antennas installed. So it's not in motion, but it's HD. It's something that you gotta pick. Which most people don't watch direct TV going down the road. They they'd rather have a HD picture when they're parked. Especially with these big fancy TVs. So that was installed. Got some nice map light. This floor is just unbelievable. So pretty. And it's heated, electric heat. It's got two zones you can control. This will put out some nice heat and it's quiet. 
between that and the fireplace, you really don't need another source of heat unless it's really cold and it does have a heat pump on the rear unit. And then also you've got the heat from the aqua heat system. So lots of heat source. And you've got three air conditioning, the 15,000 BTU, and the real one is a heat pump. This couch here is pretty good size and it pulls out and there's a bed with an air mattress in it. Now I just recently saw this, but how about all these stores right here? Very nice. Again, this leather is really, it's not the cheap one that's gonna peel eventually. It's the good stuff. Yeah, same thing on this side. Interior is just beautiful. All the accents and got the Euro chair, all the owner's manual, extra keys. All this all oh, these are cool. They're all over the place. Can't have enough of these outlets and USB. Always looking for one. There's one more here and one more in the hole. They're all throughout the box. That's right. And this this table slides out and there's one two more chairs so you can have four people. All everything is soft closed. It just closed itself. I even like the way they got the chairs tied down for traveling. Nothing crazy, just nice and clean. Beautiful. No counter Corian countertop. How about this nice farm sink? Just like in a high-end house. And of course, gotta have a dishwasher. You wouldn't be camping without a dishwasher. This is an all-electric coach, so everything is electric. This is induction cooktop. Nice microwave convection oven. got here a little pantry look at that. and it closed by itself you don't have to push it look at that really nice central vac you can sweep all your dirt and it sucks it right up got a nice residential refrigerator water dispenser an ice maker and the freezers on the bottom that's right and if you notice with the fact that it's one big slide there is no interruption, just one big open wall. This thing feels like a house. Got a wash and dryer, separate machine, the only way to go. What we got in here, a pantry. Oh yeah, nice. Put all kind of stuff. And this is a bath and a half. Love this. Oh yeah, I know. This is a glass insert with the light goes through it. They even know how to make a bathroom look beautiful. High-end faucet. These are all real metal, not plastic. And these are porcelain tile, Dometic, yeah, like you see on a boat. And they've got uh, macerator. So it's not just gravity. It kind of sucks it, chews it up, and gets rid of it. Access some breakers. Got all your vents. The fans are covered up. Yeah. Which is nice. Really nice. Yeah, they've done that with all the air system, which I'm going to show you that in a minute. And look at this master bedroom here. Beautiful king size bed. Memory foam with adjustable bed. You on can. Each side. It's got all these different settings. Each side has its own setting. Takes too long, but I can raise it up, change the shape of it. So if one of you wants to sleep or the other one wants to stay up and read, I will, this woodwork is, there's some more lights up here, isn't it? How do you turn these on? There we go. All this beautiful woodwork. Lots more control. Got outlets, 12 volt, generator plug-in, uh, starter so you don't have to get out of bed to turn it off. Or you can do it with your phone too and then USB and keep all your toys charged up overnight. Got a save and we do have the combination. Lots of storage. These TVs are smart so they've got Netflix. If you got Wi-Fi you can watch all your favorite stuff. 
everything open. Oh, it's got lights. It's got lights yeah, inside the camera. Wow. That's so cool. Very nice. Lots of storage. Yeah. They even managed to make the air system look pretty. I'm gonna show you how that works. You gonna hold it and show them? I like this. They've, they've hit it, but it's here. There's the intake with your filters, and there's the cold air coming out. Kind of diffuses it, and it does it in a pretty way. This I think it makes it a little easier to clean, too. Probably. Very nice. All right, how about this bathroom? It's just beautiful. I want a sink like that. It's all lit up, beautiful faucet. This is your emergency door. That becomes a step. It's got grid tape underneath. Same thing here with the commode. It works the same way with the buttons. Show them the shower. Look at that, you gotta open that. That raises up. And that piece of wood that's in the bottom, that's where it goes. I guess it would get scrungy eventually. That's probably why they didn't use it. How about this reinforced shower head? Beautiful faucets. Squeaky. There's your cedar line closet. There's your central vac hose system. There's your extra chairs. And there's the engine hatch for access to the top of the engine. Hopefully you won't have to mess with it. And it's the view from here. This could be a permanent home for somebody. Now, if you want to travel in ultimate style, this is it. Everything's touch control, gives you climate control. Your floors and everything. Whoops, I guess my hand's in the way. I'm sure I forgot some, there's so much to talk about. It is so roomy. Can you think of anything else? No. Yeah, there'll be a bunch of pictures too. Well, if you're looking for an awesome RV, it like new condition, which is actually better than new, because as you know, a new one's gonna have all kind of issues. All those issues have been taken care of, which is the RV, so there's always gonna be things to tinker with, but it's ready to go. Still got some factory warranty left. Uh, the capacity, that's why it's got 150 gallon of fuel tank. 100 gallon of fresh water, 60 gallon gray water, 50 gallon of black water. So plenty of capacity for staying out a few days. It's right at 45 foot long, 13 foot and a few inches. I've got it in the specs. It's a big one. decide this is what you want give us a call if you're watching this from and you're not in tennessee you can fly into memphis or nashville we can pick you up bring you to the store and you can drive home a happy camper and i'll make sure i go over everything with you to make sure you're comfortable before you leave we'll play with all the buttons and i'll be there for after the sale thank you for watching and come and see us. To see if this one is still for sale, go to my website, sunsetmotors.com.
it's on the website it's for sale if not you're too late and it's gone thank you for watching and come and see us